down all her deepest secrets, her personal thoughts about her troubled marriage, King Charles, and Queen Camilla. And now, decades after her tragic death, those secrets are finally being revealed. What do they say? And how will they change the way we see the royal family forever? In today's video, we're uncovering a royal secret that has the potential to change everything we thought we knew about Princess Diana, King Charles, and Queen Camilla. For years, royal watchers have speculated about the full story behind Charles and Diana's relationship. But what if Diana had left behind a hidden diary that finally revealed the full truth? A diary that contained not only her pain and heartbreak but also her reflections on the future of the monarchy? Stay with us, because by the end of this video, you'll hear Diana's side of the story, in her own words. Words that might just change your perspective on the royal family forever. When Lady Diana Spencer married Prince Charles in 1981, the world was captivated by what seemed like the perfect fairy tale. But behind the scenes, that fairy tale was quickly unraveling. As Diana's diary now reveals, the cracks in her marriage started much earlier than the public ever knew. One of her earliest diary entries reads, Even from the beginning, I felt like I was competing for his heart. How could I ever compare to her? Yes, her. Camilla Parker Bowles. While many royal insiders have suggested that Diana didn't realize Charles's true feelings for Camilla until years into their marriage, the diary tells a different story. Diana confesses that she had her suspicions from the very beginning, long before the public or even the press ever caught wind of the love triangle. In her diary, Diana writes about her struggles with loneliness and betrayal. I knew I wasn't the only woman in his heart. There was always another she says can you imagine living that way feeling as though you were never enough that your love wasn't enough but there's more the diary entries don't just dwell on the past they reveal diana's growing awareness of her own position in the royal family and her fears for her future in one chilling entry written just a few months before her separation from charles diana writes I sometimes wonder if I will ever be remembered for more than just this failed marriage. Will I only be the woman who lost her prince? Or will people remember me for what I tried to accomplish? Diana's diary reveals her desire to be more than just a wife. She wanted to carve out a legacy of her own. And in many ways, she succeeded. Her humanitarian work, her devotion to her children, and her ability to connect with ordinary people. These are the things we remember her for today. But it's not just the past we're uncovering. Diana's diary also touches on her thoughts about the future. Specifically, her concerns about the monarchy itself. In one startling passage, she writes, Sometimes I fear that the monarchy is too set in its ways. Too distant from the people. I wonder if it can survive, I wonder if it should. Diana's concerns weren't just about her marriage, she feared for the future of the institution she had become a part of. She worried about whether the royal family could remain relevant in a rapidly changing world. And her thoughts on Charles's future as king are perhaps the most surprising of all. In one entry, she writes, I'm not sure if Charles is prepared for what's coming. He's spent so long trying to be someone he's not. How can he lead when he's still struggling to find himself? These words are haunting, especially now that Charles has ascended to the throne. Diana's doubts about his leadership, written decades ago, raise important questions about his reign today. And what about Camilla, the woman at the center of it all? Diana had thoughts about her too, and they weren't kind. For years, people have speculated about what Diana truly thought of Camilla. In her diary, she finally opens up. I never hated her. Diana writes. But I could never understand why she had to be in my marriage, why couldn't I be enough for him? It's clear that Diana struggled with feelings of inadequacy, not because of who she was, but because of the shadow that Camilla cast over her marriage. Diana's diary speaks to the deep emotional pain she carried, pain that would ultimately lead to her decision to step away from the royal family. 
I want to hear from you. What do you think about Diana's revelations? Do they change your perspective on King Charles and Queen Camilla? Do you think Diana was right to feel the way she did? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and let's get the conversation going. And this is just the beginning. Diana's diary entries raise questions about the future of the royal family, especially now that her sons, William and Harry, are carving their own paths. Diana's influence on her sons cannot be overstated. Despite the royal protocols they were raised under, her legacy of compassion, connection, and a desire for change is evident in both William and Harry's public personas. Diana's diary reveals her hopes for her children, aspirations she nurtured even amid her own turmoil. In one poignant entry, she writes, I only hope my boys grow up to be kind and caring men. They must never forget where they come from but should always strive to make a difference. Both brothers have carried forward her legacy, embodying her ideals in their charitable work and public engagements. William's focus on mental health and Harry's dedication to social issues reflect the values Diana instilled in them. But with the revelations from her diary now surfacing, we have to ask, how will these secrets influence their roles as future leaders of the monarchy? While William is poised to inherit the throne and follow in his father's footsteps, Harry has chosen a different path, stepping away from royal duties to forge a life in the United States. The contrast raises compelling questions. How do these divergent paths reflect Diana's influence? Can the monarchy adapt to modern expectations while still honoring? Diana's fears about the monarchy's future were not unfounded. Her diary underscores a deep concern about the relevance of royal traditions in a changing society. In one particularly revealing entry, she notes, the monarchy must change or it will be left behind. People need to feel a connection to their leaders, not just see them as distant figures in fancy clothes. Today, the royal family faces a growing challenge, maintaining relevance in an era defined by social media and instant communication. With increasing calls for transparency and accountability, Diana's reflections serve as a warning to the monarchy. Can they adapt, or will they continue to cling to traditions that may no longer resonate with the public? As Diana anticipated, the world is evolving, and so are its expectations of leadership. The monarchy must navigate these waters carefully, and Diana's insights offer a valuable perspective as they do so. If Princess Diana were alive today, what would she think about the state of the monarchy? Her diary suggests a woman who was keenly aware of her role as a mother and public figure, yet also deeply conflicted about her place within the royal institution. In a world where social media reigns supreme, where every action and statement is scrutinized, how would she navigate her life? Diana's enduring legacy is one of empathy, advocacy, and strength. Her voice, even in death, continues to resonate. In her diary, she expresses a desire for the monarchy to embrace change while staying true to its core values. Her words serve as a reminder that connection and compassion should always come first. As we reflect on Diana's diary revelations, we're left with many questions. What is the true nature of love and duty? How do we balance personal happiness with public expectations? And how can the monarchy remain a pillar of stability while evolving to meet the needs of the people it serves? What do you think? I invite you to share your thoughts in the comments. What did you find most surprising about Diana's diary? Do you think her insights can help shape the future of the monarchy? Let's discuss. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more royal revelations. Princess Diana's story is one of complexity, love, and loss. Through her diary, we gain insight into her heart and her hopes for a better future, not just for her sons, but for the monarchy as a whole. As we continue to explore her legacy, may we remember the lessons she imparted about compassion, kindness, and the importance of being true to oneself.